How's it going folks? Welcome back to the channel for another video. Today I want to talk about recent leaks for the upcoming AMD Zen 3 CPUs that'll help provide us with an idea of what kind of performance levels we might be getting from AMD's next gen processors. Before we get started, remember to obliterate that like button to help with YouTube sharing this video out to others who might enjoy it. Also keep in mind that nothing is true until it is, so take all the rumors and leaks with a grain of salt. Now let's dig into the leaks. Just recently, Twitter user Appysack hope I'm saying that right, discovered a benchmark on the Ashes of Singularity benchmark site that had an RTX 2080 paired with a Ryzen 7 5800X that provided a total performance score of 5900 with the CPU frame rate averaging at about 62.8 on the crazy 4K graphics preset. Now if this leak is true, this confirms a couple of things. First off, it would prove rumors that have suggested for a short time now that the AMD Zen 3 Vermeer architecture desktop CPUs will skip the 4000 series nomenclature straight to the 5000 property, meaning we will see the Ryzen 9 5950X and 5900X as well as the Ryzen 7 5800X and 5700X and finally the Ryzen 5 5600X. I haven't heard any rumors or mentions of a Ryzen 3 5300X or equivalent CPU, but rumors and leaks suggest that the Ryzen 3, Ryzen 5, and newly introduced Ryzen 7 APUs will obtain the 4000 designation. For example, the Ryzen 3 4200G, Ryzen 5 4400G, and the new Ryzen 7 4700G that will take advantage of AMD's RDNA GPU architecture along with Zen 3 CPU cores. Finally, this benchmark would confirm with us that Zen 3 CPUs have upwards to a 20% increase in IPC per core, and its performance levels would match that of an i9-10900K. Now, AMD typically provides very tempting bang for your buck options for GPUs and CPUs, but if the Ryzen 7 5800 X can provide these levels of performance on an 8 core 16 thread setup for the same MSRP price of 400 US dollars, that would bring the fight straight to Intel for sure, especially when you consider the aforementioned i9 CPU from Intel has an MSRP price tag of close to 500 US dollars. Of course, these leaks are very exciting and Team Red should definitely be hyped about this, I know I am, but Intel does have their 1100 series Tiger Lake CPUs that should bring heavy competition to the table as well, but those CPUs I will save for a later discussion in a separate video. So that's all I really have to share for you guys today, just quick, sweet, to the point, and what we know. Make sure you let me know down in the comments which next-gen CPU you are keeping your eye out for, and as always fam, it's been my pleasure. Please stay safe, stay happy, and keep on gaming.